Hello, a vacuum fluorescent display VFD is a display device commonly used on consumer electronics equipment. VFD emits a very bright light with high contrast. This time I will show you how to make a nice retro look word clock made of such display. Word clock because current time is presented in the form of the text instead of numbers. This video is sponsored by PCB Gogo. PCB Gogo is committed to offering its customers high quality PCB and PCB assembly services with low cost and fast layout time. Visit the 2021 year end sale and get your $50 PCB and PCB assembly coupon until December 31 this year. Check out the PCB prototype and PCB assembly services discount at the link below the video. Of course, there is also a mode in which time and date are presented in standard form. Uh, as the title suggests, to make this device is uh, to make the device is used an unknown VFD serial display which previously was used as a post customer display. In one of my previous videos, I explained how to connect almost any serial VFD display to Arduino. This time I will present you another simpler way to connect VFD to Arduino. According to the markings on the chips, we will first find out which of them is a microcontroller. Uh, in this case, uh, it is a Winbond W78C32C40 microcontroller. Now in datasheet we are looking for which of the pins of the microcontroller is RX. Uh, as we see the RX pin is pin 10 of microcontroller. At this pin we bring directly the, single, the signal from the Arduino microcontroller and that is it. Of course we need also to connect uh, the power supply as described in the video above. Uh, as you see only three components are needed to make this device. VFD display taken from an old post display, Arduino Nano microcontroller, and DS3231 real-time clock module. It also has two mini switches, one for power and one for, and one for standard clock mode. The Arduino and real-time clock boards are mounted directly to the display PCB using a double-sided adhesive. This avoids making a box and enables the minima this minimalistic design. Uh, the display holder is made entirely of plexiglass. Uh, and now let's see how the device works works in reality. First we need to set the exact time on the real-time clock module and this is the simplest to do through the examples in the DS1307 library. library. We need to upload this code in Arduino and so the time is automatically adjusted, synchronized with the time from PC. After that, we upload the clock, the clock code on the Arduino and the device is ready. The exact time is indicated by words. As I said before, there is a, also a mode in which time and date are presented in standard form. We can enable this mode by second small switch.
I am from Macedonia and my native language is Macedonian, so I made a code where the time is displayed in Macedonian with Cyrillic alphabet. Also standard clock. Thank you.